this is Jody King Colgrove with Quantum Techniques. We have developed a proven technique to quickly determine the root cause of your health issue using a form of energy medicine. I work with people all over the world on the phone, helping them understand why they're having a health issue and what they can do about it. Today I wanted to talk about kids' health. I uh, recently had an article that I saw that I thought was really profound and said it quite well, so I really kind of wanted to share that. Um, uh, someone asked um, that um, my son has digestive issues, multiple food and environment allergies, chronic sinus congestion, and behavioral problems, also attention deficit disorder, and he's only 10 years old. What in the world is going on? So the, uh, the article writes back and says that digestive problems, food allergies, asthma, autism spectrum disorder and attention deficit disorder are all on the rise. And they said that one in three Americans have one of those, which I think is quite astounding and very sad. So what is um, making children sick? So she says basically it's the environment that has been toxic by, or been made toxic by um, uh, agricultural industrialization food production. Kids are being exposed to pesticides and foreign chemicals um, through what they eat, what they drink, and externally by being exposed to pesticides and substances that are sprayed on schools, parks, and daycare centers. So one of the things she talks about is glycosate, which is the active ingredient in Roundup, and it's an um, herbicide. And its use has increased from 19... 74 to 2014 by 300 percent. So it is definitely increased. <laughs> um, glycosate has is considered a uh, patented antibiotic and it kills bacteria, which means it can also kill the good bacteria, not just the bad bacteria. So um, it contributes to the development of the imbalance in the gut microbiome, which is that whole gut flora, like I said, the good guys and the bad guys. And that's why you take probiotics to make sure you keep all the good guys. Um, the healthy microbiome plays a vital role in the digestive health and also your immunity, because you need to have really good immunity in order to fight some of these things off. Glycosate is also a uh, metal chelator, which means that it binds minerals such as zinc and magnesium um, so that they're less available for the body and the kid to use in their bodies. Um, so therefore, we have lots of kids with mineral deficiencies. Um, it's also considered a human carcinogen by the World Health Organization. So it's really not something we should be using. Another chemical that's hidden in food, and I'm not going to pronounce that, but its, it's call symbols are BT, which is found in, in insecticides producing genetically modified foods, like GMOs. Okay, BT breaks open pores and um, <clears throat> um, creates small holes in the insect's guts. So if it's doing that to the insects, so that the insects will die, it's also doing that to our gut. And it's creating holes, and that's why you hear a lot of times people saying that their intestines are permeable or they have leaky gut. And that's what, what's causing that, that GMOs. So how do we combat these toxins? Okay, well, one of the biggest things we can do is eat an organic diet. But it's also some of the other things that we can do is find out what are the toxins or what are the foods that you shouldn't be eating that are creating this issue. And that's really important. One of the biggest things you can do for the things I just mentioned, whether it's asthma, ADHD, um, autism spectrum disorder, behavioral problems, um, uh, um, you know, sinus congestion, is to find out what are the foods that are impacting the that person and get them to not eat those for a period of time so the body can heal itself. There's lots of different herbs that you can take and things like that, but it's really finding out what those toxins are that you shouldn't be eating. So I found that to be a profound article because I, I do find that, you know, having a kid in school that there's just a lot of that discussion going on and what do we do about it. So those are some things that can help. You can visit our website at quantumtechniques.com and we have lots of free downloads and MP3 um, you know, like downloads and codes for you to look at that are helpful for you. You can 
request a session request and um, that will give us some time to kind of find out what your toxins are and what um, you should be staying away from in order to help um, your issue heal. And so at Quantum Techniques, that's where the healing begins and your illness ends. So thank you from Quantum Techniques. Blessings.